Hello traders, uh, welcome back to the third uh, lesson on this very important course on how to journal your trades. So uh, the last two lessons we saw how to um, actually upload your trades to the trading journal, but now we are going to look at how to create the setups that you, uh, you, that you use to trade. The main reason that this is important is because uh, you are going to want to tag every single trade with uh, its own setup because at the end of everything I'm going to show you how to do profitability analysis and you're and you're going to need that in order to filter out every single one of the setups and just analyze, uh, uh, analyze one of them. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our trading journal uh, but before we go to the trading journal I'm going to show you exactly what I'm going to be journaling. All right, so uh, let's go to the, to the actual journal and uh, I'm going to journal uh, my last uh, trade on the US dollar Swiss franc. It was a sale on the US dollar Swiss franc, so I'm going to look at the US dollar Swiss franc right here. Um, US dollar Swiss franc, it was a sale. These were the three trades and uh, 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 yes it was a win uh, that we sold all the way up here let me see yep we made $94 right uh, this is the trade that I'm going to be journaling and uh, I'm going to show you the setup this is the setup that I'm going to be journaling so uh, to explain the uh, uh, this is a setup that I call the uh, well reversal a key level uh, and uh, this is what I'm going to be journaling because I'm going I'm also going to be journaling and I'm going to be taking a screenshot and uh, uh, the journal uh, is going to um, load that screenshot onto that specific trade so let's go to the journal and uh, I'm going to uh, what we're going to do is you're going to go to settings to the settings ta settings tab at the top of the journal and you are going to choose the third um, uh, well the third option called setups and you are going to create a new setup in this case I'm going to create a reversal a key level and I like to use uh, all caps when I type key level all right and I'm going to add the strategy this is a reversal at key level now now that the strategy is added onto my journal you go to the actual journal you look for the uh, for the for the trade that you're going to be adding that uh, set of two and uh, it's actually uh, this one right here and this one right here both of these ones are uh, trades that I took on that um, uh, no, actually just the one uh, that I took uh, a couple of days ago, exactly, and, I'm, and we made $94. So uh, right here, we're going to go to the, uh, you're going to double click on the, uh, you're going to double click on the, uh, uh, the trade, on your trading journal, and uh, this uh, window to edit your trade is going to appear. And right here, you just choose reversal at key level. Now, now that you have reversal at key level, you go to advanced trade data, right? And once you're here, you are going to be uploading from your computer. You're going to be uploading that, uh, uh, well, the screenshot that uh, we, uh, uh, that of the setup. Now, I haven't uh, had the, the uh, opportunity to uh, load this or, or to save the screenshot onto my computer, so I'm going to be doing it right now and uh, click on save and uh, it's saved all right so we go back to the journal all right uh, let's put on the entire journal here well that's fine uh, and uh, uh, you click on upload from computer I have it on pictures and it's the last screenshot right here so it's uploaded to my trading journal and uh, you also um, uh, have these custom that custom stats and the trade comments right uh, custom comment uh, what I use is simply the uh, the exact uh, or the comments that I use are simply the exact uh, 
trigger or the exact setup that I use. For example, on this one right here, you can see that uh, it was a reversal at key level that, um, uh, uh, and I entered when the reversal, uh, the reversal structure broke. So entry at breakout of reversal structure. And uh, you are going to, and because I have the screenshot on my, uh, on my trade, I know exactly what I'm talking about. So let me finish typing that and I'm going to save it. And as you can see, uh, the setup has been changed. And if I double click on, on my trade, the screenshot also has been saved. And if I double click my screenshot, I have the screenshot on my journal. So whenever I'm going to be looking at, uh, at this, uh, or whenever I'm going to be analyzing my past trades and I have a trade that, that, is, that has been flagged, like the one I flagged on the Euro US dollar, which I'm going to upload the, um, uh, or w which I'm going to go through the process of uploading the, the uh, screenshot to, I am going to be able to do uh, to go to that exact trade and see why it's flagged with a uh, or flagged uh, with uh, red and uh, why it was a loser. Um, but basically, this is how you add setups to your to your journal and how you use the advanced data on your journal. All right. So uh, I'm, what I'm going to be doing before the next video is I'm going to. Uh, put, I'm, I'm going to create all of the setups that I use and I'm going to be uh, doing this for every single one of the trades that I have on my journal so that we can go ahead and move to the actual uh, manipulation of the data.